Hi, and so the tutorial I'm going to show you how to use the pen tool on photo P, uh, website. So all you need to do, first of all, is just go and open the browser that you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. So of course, here in my case, I'm actually using Brave, but of course, in your case, you can use any other browser could be possibly working for you. So of course, when you open your browser, just go to the URL section and type photo P.com and hit the enter button. So that will certainly will take you into this page. And of course, from here, you have four options. You have the option of creating a new projects, opening something from your, from your computer, or you can choose something from the PSD templates, or you can just drop your file right there and start editing on. So for me, I'm just going here and click, uh, I'm going to click as new projects. And of course, I'm going to choose one of the templates right here. Let's just choose the first one. And let's just wait until it loads right here. So of course, every template you have here or everything like you added, you will find every component of that template right here on the right. So of course, you can like move it, uh, start editing on it, or you can just go back by hitting the control Z to go back to the original case. So of course, today, as I said, I'm going to show you how to use the pen Two. So where is it? First of all, as you can see, there is a T here at the left. Just go below it and click at the pin right here. So of course, first of all, we have three options. We have the pin and the free pin and the curvature pin. So of course, you choose whatever you want and it's just a tool for drawing. So first of all, I advise you to choose this free pin because it's much easier. As you can see, you draw whatever you want and it will be drawn right here in your template. So of course, as we said, there is three other options because this pen is kind of like hard to draw with it, with it unless you are like professional at doing this. I suggest you to use this free pen because it's like easier. And of course, there is the third option, which is this curvature pen. So, of course, that is uh, simple as well. You can just let me just go back. You can just uh, like create one like this and then of course, you can start editing on it. So, that will be actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.